Welcome to Mushroom Wonderland. Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Aaron Hillier. I'm out here in this forest. It's a little bit different. It's a lot of alder and a little bit of like spruce, I guess. A lot of nettles. But one thing I stumbled upon are some of my favorite mushrooms. And these are called the shaggy parasol. Now this is also known as Chlorophyllum oliverii or Chlorophyllum rachodes. So let's take a look and I'll show you what these look like. And they're awesome to eat with like a steak. Man, they are the best. And there's a certain way to know that these are the ones that you're looking for. As you can see, this kind of environment I'm in, a lot of moss, alder leaves, and uh, but I've found them in other type of environments, but actually this is where I mostly find them. So I'm just cruising along and would you look at what I ran into? It's the parasol mushroom. And uh, they are a beautiful mushroom. You can see there's a ring under here. The ring is detached. Well, that one, I kind of broke it. It's got some identifying characteristics. It's got a very shaggy looking cap on it. They grow to about eight inches around. And when they're young, it just looks like a cake pop. It looks like a ball on a stick. When they open up, it leaves a ring behind on the stem, and this ring you can actually slide up and down the stipe of the mushroom. It's kind of, kind of a cool feature of them. Another really distinguishing feature of this mushroom is that when you break the stem on it, it's going to stain red, kind of a maroon, blood red color. If you've got the ring that slides up and down, the shaggy cap, and then it stains red inside, I would be willing to bet that you have found yourself Chlorophyllum rachodes or Chlorophyllum oliverii you have found yourself the shaggy parasol mushroom. Oh, smokes. Look at all of these. So they often do this. They grow in a huge patch like this. And, uh... <laughs> we found these mushrooms. Awesomeness. I'm gonna come back and get some buttons later on. Um, and we're gonna make some steak with parasol mushrooms. It's gonna be amazing. So good luck picking. These are the ones for today. These are the good ones. You, you wanna get these before the worms get them. Another thing about them, the stems are super woody, so you don't really wanna be eating those. No. Just the caps. Look at that one. That's freaking perfect. But signing off, subscribe for more mushroom hunting. Thanks.